I'm a skinny yeah, uh, man. <laughs> this don't make no damn sense. All right, y'all, we back again. Upper body day. Got Ariel, she's starting it off. We got Destiny right here. We got Jamika right here, first time on the video. And we starting off with push ups. They're doing assisted. They do this on the home workout when they're not with me. But majority of the time they with me anyway, so they just be doing extra shit, which is good. Ain't nothing wrong with extra credit. I always apply extra credit. Like Jamika, she already tight from doing it earlier, which I told her, which I tell them, they don't have to do this, the home workout, unless they don't make it to me. The fuck it up. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Then in week four, getting it in. There we go. Now she's doing a different variation that I taught her on Upper Body Day that a couple of them missed, which is like diamond push-ups, pretty much close push-ups, working triceps and shoulders as well. I tell people they can alternate between both, you know, to depend on comfortability. I love when it's like this. It's so much better. That last one, I'm going to do the plane. You on three, honey. Stop it. That was three, right? That was three, right? Yeah, so you got two more. That has to be on three. Breathe as you go down and blow as much out as you come up. Remind y'all, people in general, any exercise, try to go as low as you can. And you know what I'm saying? You'll get better as you keep doing it in repetition. All right, so I'm gonna cut all the other stuff out and just go ahead and do a voiceover for the rest. So for the first, you know what I'm saying, exercise after the warm up, which is the body weight movement, um, they're doing front raises with the bar. And this is just to get overall front delt health and um, strength and development. And you know what I'm saying, just getting you, you know what I'm saying, right for your upper body to get work in other areas. Also, mind you, while doing this exercise, you need to keep your core tight. So this is also beneficial for ab training and strength in the ab area because you have to brace yourself to keep that bar in the right motion and the right groove to work it, especially when you add weight. Next is um, a dumbbell row variation. Now we're not using dumbbells, we're just using these plates to have handles. But um, pretty much you're gonna start off with a neutral grip and then you're gonna rotate it to be an underhand grip. This is just a different just feel for the row and also it just helps isolate each individual lat in the back, which is like a peck um, of your chest. So once you do that rotation, it kind of adds a different feel for the contraction. And then when you come back down in the neutral for the scratch. So this is perfect for to get that waist snatch because people don't understand that the waist, it also has the back a part of it. So if you're doing your rows like this or underhanded or just dumbbells in general, you will definitely see better results. you also see this see machines that imitate this as well. That makes it easier to get the pump. But I always tell people free weights as better stability, especially for the core. A lot of these exercises free weight wise are beneficial for core development as well. Purchase your tracks today. Then of course, we're gonna do a pressing movement. This is just a good way to burn more calories while also building strength. And this is a general exercise to build strength in all totality. Shoulder presses, anything pushing overhead, you know, even benching, 
anything pushing and exerting is good for overall strength because it's a natural movement. It's a natural thing you do on a normal basis. So I always tend to end my exercises with them doing this because, like I said, it burns more calories and also it builds overall strength. So of course they warm up with push-ups, assisted, but at the end I like to do another pressing movement to get an extra um, cardio type benefit. Then the ab exercise we chose to do today was to do Russian twists. Now mind you, at the beginning you might not be able to have your feet up. That's okay. Just try to get your feet in the proper placement like I have been doing here. And um, it would definitely, um, you'll still feel the benefit. And then over time, as you get more experience, lift them feet up to get your lower ab involved as well. And it would definitely be beneficial because to get total ab development, you have to work it in all angles. A lot of my exercises in general is about angles. That's how you shape the body. It's about hitting every angle of the body in a, um, a strategic manner. All right, and you see, I got them doing some cardio, running back and forth, back and forth. As you see, I got my daughter Kaylee, she's in it. <laughs> she always loves to be active, so she's definitely motivating them as well for me. And um, that's just it, you know, if you move your body enough for a certain amount of time, you get the pounds down, and then you do some strength training to shape the body. That's what this whole thing is about, is that you don't have to do certain exercises that I do that's more detailed work, but if you do some stuff that's for overall health and beneficial um, development, and um, just do some cardio to get the pounds down, and you'll have the body that you want. You just gotta keep your eye on the prize, stay consistent, stay disciplined, and you will get it and the results will come. Alright y'all, that's another episode of Big Dog Baddies. This is week four. That's Ariel. She tired as hell. Then we got Destiny. She definitely been a trooper. And then we got Jamika and her daughter. And then, hey, they drank. It's another week. Keep them motivated. Like I say, follow them. Follow Big Dog Fitness 44804 on Instagram. And remember, yeah, it might be bigger than me, might be stronger than me, might not, be, might be faster than me, have more money than me, might have a lot more shit than me. But in there, you ain't gonna outwork me, and you ain't gonna outwork them. Her ass, working her ass off. So, alright, y'all. Like, comment, and subscribe.